Hello everyone, welcome back to Heavy Rain. We're continuing off right where we left. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Are you alright? I... I killed a man. I had no choice. I had no choice. You're not the origami killer, Ethan. You're not responsible for those murders. I can prove it. That changes nothing. Saving Sean is all that matters now. Hey, God damn it. Huh. God game, why you always gotta do this shit to me? Ah, I want that. I want that to thing. I ship the piss out of that. Huh. Why does it always gotta do that shit to me? Everyone, everyone wants that. I mean, clearly his wife doesn't fucking love him no more. They may as well bone. They may as well. Yeah, it may as well. Here we go, Wheat Thin, you're all good now. <laughs> Wheat Thin. Uh, Ethan, you're fine, buddy. You, you guys gonna fucking make out and fuck on in this motel room. For damn sure. Ethan. Are you alright? I killed a man. <laughs> I had no choice. I had no choice. You're not the origami killer, Ethan. You're not responsible for those murders. I can prove it. That changes nothing. Saving Sean is all that matters now. Is it gonna be circled to not to kiss now? Or to not kiss now? Come on, kiss. Yes, curse. I was loving doing this shit. Yeah, they gotta fuck on that bed. Yeah, they gotta fuck on that bed. In case anyone was wondering, I am fully erect. Yep, that's just what I wanted. I'm happy for Ethan. I like I dig this couple.
Yeah, yeah, they took they yep, yeah, they took all their clothes off now. There you go. There you go. There you go. That's a happy ending. Cut this fucking cut everything else. That is a just fine ending. Oh yeah, I forgot to fucking cut off a bit of a singer. <laughs> Them was some pro that sounded like some good ass sex. Not even time to put some fucking pants on. Oh shit. Put your pants on, boy, and smack that ass. Do it, Ethan. You're a real man. You got this shit. Ethan, everywhere you go, you look like shit. <laughs> the mouse. So this, the, this might be the last one. Maybe. Oh, you faggot. <laughs> You said no, it's not how it is, god damn it. I should have guessed. All this time and I had no idea. Ethan, what's the matter? I thought I meant something to you. Listen, I you're a pretty good nurse for a fucking journalist! Oh, Ethan. Ethan, I, I, I wanted to tell you, but... What kind of article were you gonna write? My life with a serial killer? No, no, no. How I caught the origami killer. Maybe you'll get a book deal. I hope it was fucking worth it! Ethan, it's not what you think. I... You lied to me, Madison! All this time you fucking lied to me! I thought you wanted to help me, but you're only thinking of writing a fucking book?! of the boy who had disappeared and and I wanted to cover the story but then I saw what you were going through to save your son and and I understood how much you love him I wanted to tell you the truth but I couldn't I was afraid that you that you may not believe me 
I was afraid that you'd ask me to go. All I want is for you to find your son alive. And when it's all over, I want to be with you. You forgive the shit out of Ethan. Don't you even give me no damn choices. I'm sorry, Ethan. I'm so sorry. I believe you, Madison. I do. You're leaving. Aren't you? It's the last origami thing. The last letters. I don't know where Sean is. Take care, Ethan. I can't lose you now. Yeah, we got this shit down packed, Madison. We got, we got, we got all this good. We're good. We're doing, we're doing fine. I'm gonna go find something to eat. Wait for me. I'll, I'll be back in ten minutes. Oh. He is not gonna wait even a single minute. He wouldn't believe me. Wrong move, idiot. I should have admitted everything earlier. Hmm. Well, see, that's how you know she's genuine, because she's just legit. Uh, sorry. We'll find his son and prove he's innocent. I'll be able to help him now that he knows who I am. Cops. They're looking for Ethan. It looks like a raid. Oh, well, he's not going to be there when they get there. Guarantee. What's going on? Who'd have thought it? The origami killer renting a room here. He registered under a false name, but I recognized his face. Come on, what was the damn number? Jesus. Crap, that's not it. Just 207. Two oh seven. Come on, come on. Pick up the phone. Hello? The cops. They're in the motel. You've got to get out of here. Go oh shit. Jump even, jump this shit. You're a parkour Jesus. That. <coughs> Sorry, Brent. Yeah, shit. Shit. Go on the roof, Ethan. That's the only hope. Come on. Come on. Nope, run. Ah. Nope. <laughs> Get fucked. <laughs> Down. Why they haven't shot me yet is beyond me. Whew, 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 whew. 
A criminal sucked my ass. <laughs> crap, crap, crap. Bro, you got this. It's over. On your knees, hands behind your head. Easy, pal. Nowhere to go. You're surrounded. Jump! Holy fuck. Come on, Ethan, you're fine. You let it on some nice soft wood. Let's go. Oh, bro. Ethan, get in the fucking cab already. Oh, shit, I'm just, I'm just jacking this guy, hell yeah. I'm stealing your cars, what's the matter with me? Ah! Now I am the cabbie. Huh. Your blood lock thickens. There you go. Got the trophy lover boy. And escape master as well. Hmm. Lord? I'm sorry, Scott. You should have listened to me, Mr. Shelby. I told you to drop the investigation. Wow. He's a serial killer. How many people does he have to kill before you turn him in? Gordy has his faults, but he's still my son. You have no children, Mr. Shelby. You can't possibly understand. You leave me no choice. Your investigation is over. For good. Wow, Lauren. Way to be a bitch. Fuck! Lauren! Uh, uh, shit! Oh, fuck! Lauren! Lauren, wake up! Lauren! Fuck! Goddamn fool. Nothing's gonna work if I don't switch on that ignition. Come on. Oh, we're gonna die. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. We're gonna fucking die. Oh, shit. All right, make the fuck up already. Shit. 
Alright, wake the fuck up! Oh shit, fucking Shelby can carry her. Oh my god, he's a fucking god. Holy shit. Holy crap, though. Freaking trying to drown me and shit? That ain't cool. I was gonna take up swimming again. This isn't exactly what I had in mind. You got a car back at your place? Mine's obviously pretty fucked up. Yeah, sure. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna go settle a few scores. Come on, I'll take you home. I'll lock your doors and windows and don't let anybody in but me. Okay? Be careful, Scott. I don't want to lose you. Hmm. I think we're probably going to end the video here pretty soon. So, I thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see all of you in the next video. Where uh, we're going to continue, obviously. Bye-bye.